welcome to my unreal engine code tutorial series and today in this episode we gonna learn how to make uh, your player key is pressed being tapped or being hold so on uh, be, before that you may want to do certain things and after this tutorial you gonna learn how you gonna see if our your player's uh, key is being pressed or being hold and you can do certain things on from that so open your player's blueprint this is my unreal engine third person character and in this blueprint we're gonna call create a macro we're gonna call it hold slash tap and we're gonna make if our key is being pressed or being hold so how are we gonna do that so first thing first let's make an input uh, sorry for that the first is pressed this would be execute node this one second is released this would also be an execute node and third would be a duration and this would be a float uh, what is a duration so let's say I want to hold for 5 seconds so the duration would be 5 seconds so you can uh, just change it to whatever you want that's why I set it this duration for the output node you want to check whether it's hold so the execute node or whether it's tapped something like this so uh, after calculating this you are gonna set if it's hold or being tapped and for that uh, let's create a uh, something like 4 key and inside that I want to just grab that macro from that I want to set this both to press then released if my 4 is being tapped then I want to print tap and if it's being hold then I want to print hold so tap so for the hold purpose I have printing hold and for the tap I am printing the tap Hit compile and save and let's get back to your macro so we need certain things first is a sequence right and attach it to here and what is the sequence is so sequence follows from 0 1 2 3 that one so you can uh, uh, when your 0 is uh, completed then and then it will gonna go to your one part so from this get a read triggerable delay and this would be your duration from the trigger it will gonna follow so the duration would be obviously your duration which we have just made the input uh, make this but here and make some room here the durations completed part would go to your gate so your gate flow control and when your duration is complete your gate would be opened after opening your gate get your this uh, this you know, this part would be go to your gate so after entering your gate your gate should be opened and from that let's make another sequence inside here so sequence and this would be your for closing the gate so on the released so when you uh, press the release button your gate should be closed simple just duplicate that by control w so duplicate uh, and add a pin if it's not true if uh, if it's not true i mean if it's just holding down then the gate would be not closed so if it's not true then what we are gonna do we are gonna make a enter function so how do you gonna do that so on your this one the then zero it will gonna enter your gate function your gate node so your gate or two would be opened and this one should be open your gate so like this and from this first get a sequence and what we're gonna do so your first sequence we're gonna close your gate and after that attach your this one to hold and 
this one to tap so if our duration is less than our players pressed one then we gonna say that yeah this key is being tapped or say pressed and released but if duration is greater than or equal to this then we say that this key, key is being hold so let's say for 5 seconds and let's say if it's working or not press play so am I, I am right now pressing 4 and you can see this is tap but if I uh, hold down this key then you can see this would print hold after 5 seconds so hold yep you can see that tap 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 and then if I hold down then hold you can find this code of this macro in the official website of unreal engine force documentation so i have just grabbed this that code from here and if it's hold then you can follow this part if it's false then you can follow this part so this is all thank you so much guys for watching and bye bye